In this next video, I'm going to be talking about spine tilt backswing. Is your game lacking consistency? Did you know it could be traced back to your incorrect spine tilt in your backswing? Well, in this next video, I'm going to show you exactly how to fix it with a really simple exercise anyone can get good at. Sound good? Keep watching. Hi, it's Troy from Hitting It Solid here. Thanks for watching. So let's talk about this spine tilt backswing. So, so I'm set up to a ball here. First thing that I always like to do, which is really important at setup, is to get a little bit of that access tilt. Now it's not critical, particularly with your irons, but it certainly helps you to get into that nice position. It's even more important with your driver. I've just got an iron here today. But as we're set up here, we want to make sure those shoulders get that little bit of tilt there that set up. You can see that's flat and that's a little bit of tilt and that's because for a right hander, with my right hand on the club, my right shoulder, my rear shoulder will naturally be a little bit lower at address and a great way to practice this is two really simple ways that work is to put this right in your sternum, wait till it hits, hits right at the base of your lead leg and that way you know you've got the right amount of axis tilt that's set up. And the other thing you can do as I'm set up here is just move these hips a fraction forward like that and that naturally gets you that little bit of access tilt that set up. Now the real big key when it comes to spine tilt in backswing down the line I'll show you this at setup you can see here we never stand at the ball with a straight back like this we always bend at the hips and lean over and we've got this angle, this spine tilt at address from our hips right up to our shoulder here over the golf ball. Now it's absolutely vital that this spine tilt, this angle that you've created at setup, is maintained throughout the entire backswing and then the downswing. So in the backswing, the most common problem I see golfers doing, they'll have this nice spine tilt at setup, but as they turn away, they'll stand up and the shoulders here will get very level at the top. Absolutely key, and this is a huge contributor to solid ball striking, is maintaining that spine tilt throughout the backswing and the downswing. But we're talking about the backswing. So it's really important, this angle we've created, as you make your backswing, we maintain it. You can see there I've maintained that angle from the golf ball. I'm not further away from the ball. If I stood up I'd be further away. I've maintained that angle. If you can do that it will go a long way to helping you hit consistent golf shots. So as I turn away I've maintained it and the next part of that is if you can make a 90 degree turn, we want to be turning around that spine tilt. So we don't want to be turning 90 degrees from this position here, standing up tall. I'd like to see you, if you can, depending on your flexibility, is turn around that 90 degrees, around that spine angle. So I've got my angle here, it's set up. And I'd like to see you turn and turn around that spine angle to 90 degrees. If you can do that, you're in a fantastic position for the rest of the golf swing. It will make a huge difference. Now in a moment I'm going to show you a really simple exercise you can practice this to really build this into your game, help you play some really great golf. Stick around. Okay, here's a great exercise you can do to maintain that spine tilt in the backswing. So, as I said before, it's really important that you maintain that angle at setup, and the key to that is ensuring that that left shoulder, this is for a right hander, remains low and moves in in that backswing. So, from this angle here, we want to feel like in that backswing that, that left shoulder goes down and in. So, from face on, you might see it a little bit clearer. So left shoulder goes down and it goes in more in this direction here into the center of our sort of our sternum area here. So we want to feel like that left shoulder goes down like that. We don't want it going up high like that. So really important. Now 
a really effective way of practicing this and if you've got a mirror or a phone or something as a reference point so you can see yourself doing this it will be really beneficial but grab a club you don't have to get golf shots with this put it across your chest set up to a ball and when you turn I want to see the butt of this club pointing somewhere around the ball or just beyond the ball there when I do that I know I've kept that left shoulder low and I've turned my shoulders on that 90 degree on that 90 degree turn but I've turned the shoulders maintaining that spine tilt so here we go if I do this incorrectly this is what happens if I stand up butt of that club's going to be pointing way out there so we want it pointing down towards the golf ball we want it pointing somewhere in that direction there and if you do that it will make a huge difference in the way you make your backswing and your ball striking a mirror is really effective for this and the other benefit this will flow onto in your downswing if you can make this turn getting this left shoulder low you'll feel like you're closer to the golf ball I'll demonstrate one here I keep my left shoulder low I feel like I'm closer to the ball right here now as I switch it around into the downswing this will help you make sure your right arm in particular is bent and when your right arm is bent down towards that delivery position you're able to create lag and really compress the golf shot so it has a real flow on effect getting this spine tilt in your backswing right has a really good flow on effect for the rest of your golf swing give that drill a try you can do that inside your house just in front of a mirror keeping that left shoulder low maintains that spine tilt and has some really powerful effects in the rest of your swing if you have any questions or comments about that please let me know thanks for watching see you next time click and watch the video on your screen now it's going to go into more detail about how the left shoulder works in the backswing which ties in really well with this video here if you want to learn how to play amazing golf consider subscribing to the channel and remember if you do have any questions or comments please let me know i will get back to you thanks for watching see you next time